so hi everybody this is your stay at home grandma and i did not i have not made a regular time yet i'm going to try to do it in the morning but i'm doing it as i go along because my day is not mapped out like that but i'm going to try to do it so that i can actually put myself on some time anyway we're going to get started so I'm going to start marching. How's everybody doing? I'm doing fine. See, I want to get rid of this little tire iron right here. Okay, that's my march. Now I'm going to do my feet. You may think that that's not working, but for older people, you know, sometimes we don't feel our feet, you know, our feet become numb, things like that. Also, you know, I have a pinch over my shoulder, so later on this week I'm going to show you some, if you've had one, you know what I'm talking about, some um, exercises that will help. Then we're going to rock these feet back and forth. And then go. Ten minutes a day is all you need. And we're going to march again. I might not be able to go the whole ten minutes yet, but I will. swimming and I don't know how to swim I think I told you that yesterday window wiping row wasn't on the rowing team in college either or high school Now these are one of the one of the exercises for the pinch nerve. Okay, now if we can do this every day for a month and then bring it to three times a week, but I might not do it. I might try to do it every day for a month after. Let's see if I can hang on every day. I'm going to make sure that I do this every day for my, so that may be Christmas day. We'll see. Now these will strengthen your knees. Now I'm going to do window wipers, or whirl, whirlwinds, I think. Now these hurt a little bit. And we're going to change directions. We see all that on that's hanging down? I want to get rid of that, but the best way I know how. And don't think because we're old and our body starts sagging. Let me put this up. But this will also help you with going up and, you know, like when you're trying to put a box up, because I found that, okay, this is the arm that bothers me a lot. Not so much today. Try to get 10 in. 7, 8, 9. And ten now. Oof. I'll do these as much as I can. Should be ten. I'll be able to go faster as I go along. Whew. Now take a deep breath. 
a little. But this is the arms I want. I don't, I don't want all that flab on my arms. This is good for circulation. Now I'm going to get one. Lift up your toes, on your toes. You can almost see it. I'm going to have to move the chair back just a little bit further next time. We're going to do 10 of those. 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Now, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. But again, strengthening your knees. Take a deep breath. Now we're gonna do these with hand weights eventually. I have hand, little hand weights. I'll show you before I get off. Again, strengthening the knees. Let's see what time it is. Do these again. Try to do this with the arms. It's hard for me to concentrate on this, doing two things at one time. I don't know. But anyway. I'm going to breathe. Now, last one. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, this is going to be kind of hard, so I'll try to do it because I got a little bit too close to the bed. Breathe again. Breathe in, breathe out. Okay. Last one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now, they go. Oh, they're up here. These are the weights that I'm going to be using. If you eventually, I'll tell you when we're going to call for weights, probably more towards the end of the week. If you don't have weights, get two milk crates and put them on. Fill them with some sand or some dirt and use them for milk crate. Okay, I gotta go. I love you. Take care. God bless. Stay safe. Bye bye. Mm. See you in the next video.